I mean, it is right over us. What was the problem? Thank you so much. So it's a little bit expensive. I'm Cindy, and this is Shell. We sold everything and set off on an adventure, living and cruising on a boat named Seashell. Click subscribe and sit back as we show you that it's possible for all of us to live an extraordinary life. Good morning. Okay. Still stormy. Still storming. Yeah. Trying to get into Spanish Wells today. Yeah. Sometime. We got a dock for seven days. As soon as we pull into that dock, the sun will clear. The wind will stop. It will be yeah. perfect for the whole time around the dock. Yeah. Thunderstorms will be over for the seven days that we stay there. Once we leave, It'll start up. they'll start. It's stormy. I mean, it is right over us. storm is over and it's now cleared away. It's around 2 o'clock. We've been waiting like all day to leave to come into Spanish Wells. We made it to Spanish Wells. The dock is $25 a day. Oh, 50 cents a kilowatt, I think. Yep, 50 cents a kilowatt. Water is unlimited, but it is um, brackish-ish. Well, it's city water. Yeah. But it's, sometimes it's not that great. Anyways, there's no wind in here. You don't have to worry about no storm shelling here. This is, uh, it's nice and uh, warm. Yeah, and, uh, we're gonna get our bikes out. Yeah, we're gonna get our bikes out. We're gonna enjoy it you here, You can get a uh, golf cart for? 250 a week. Right. It seems how people get around here a lot is by the golf carts. There's goats. Look how cute. Hello. Oh my goodness, we're gonna have to get them food. I'm sure they are not. Do they? What? Oh, you want your ear scratched. Okay. Yeah. No, buddy. Hi. Oh, you're adorable. I know. Look at them all. Got a golf cart. We got a golf cart. So we're now we're gonna really enjoy Spanish wells. Yes. So I gotta get the line for the shredded line on the uh, dinghy davit. Uh, I gotta talk to the marina place where they get the boat yard to see how much it is get hauled out and bottom paint done, just for curiosity's sake. Also wanna ask if there's someone that can dive and clean the bottom here, Let's see. Um, I need spare oil for the engine because I think I'm going to replace the oil. 
It's due. Uh, I think that's it. You got to oh, go to the clinic. Go to Spanish Wells Canvas to get the, the thing fixed from the storm the other day. Look at that. All ripped up. Yeah. It's got to be fixed. Yeah, I got to go to the clinic about my ear problem. See if, but I don't think I'll do that now. We're running now. Now no. we'll go right to uh, the canvas place. Yeah. And then we'll go to the boat yard and the boat, boat uh, the marine hardware store. Right. And then... Food? <laughs> We're going to go check out the shipyard restaurant after Sheldon does all his errands. All right, to our vehicle. I love it. On this, thinking it's on. Oh my goodness. Thanks, man. Have you ever seen that? Okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay. My golf cart driver. <laughs> This is the um, canvas shop. We now we're at Boatyard, and Sheldon wants, boat wants to just know about bottom pain, is it? This is the shipyard. We've arrived to our destination. Look at the view. Nice, huh? Oh, beautiful. Something about the wonderful way the sun is coming up today.
just had another fun ride in the machine golf cart. Now we're going into uh, the grocery store food fair and pick up a few odds and ends. Haven't had groceries either since whew, a couple weeks. Okay, so uh, we got groceries. We got it done really quick. This golf cart is awesome. And so now we're gonna go to the beach, sit down, relax. It's about five o'clock before we do dinner. No, I can say it's a really good day to be alive. I can see the city from my roof, from my roof. The watercolor sky, the day is new, the day is new. There's beauty all around that gets me high, gets me high. We're swimming, but there's quite a few jellyfish. Sheldon's out there. It's too many jellyfish for me to like, but uh, I'll bring you out to show them. Oh, I know I can say it's a really good day to be alive. Can I find a way? It's a really good day to be alive. Oh, the sky. That's it for us. Uh, we enjoyed a lovely, lovely time on the beach. Tide has come in. We're watching the sunset. It's like 7.30, so we feel like we gotta go home, get something to eat, but it's beautiful. I mean, this is beautiful. This is why we do it all. glorious morning from Spanish Wells and today we're going to go to Harbor Island so we have to take a ferry to the mainland Eleuthera and then we have to get a taxi to get another ferry and then that ferry is going to take us to Harbor Island so that's what we're off to we're packing our bags and uh, it's Pink Sand Beach it's uh, Harbor Island is the Pink Sand Beach that we're yeah. Is this what? Yeah. We're gonna check out the uh, marina over there, Valentine's. They got a dive center and stuff, which would have been awesome to go visit it, but I don't think we're gonna be able to have time to go around and uh, do that. I can't anyway. Oh yeah, Sheldon's ear problem. Yeah, it's infected. So he's not supposed to get his ears wet. That's the plan. Let's see if it all comes together. Yeah, and I was iffy on it first, but uh, on, on the cost, it sounded like, oh, two ferries and taxis and whatever, but they say it's $5 a person. It'll still be 60 bucks, because it'll be 30 over, 30 back. So we're gonna go over and be tourists and uh, check out the little gift shops and stuff like that. Here we go. in our golf cart. Sheldon wants to stay another couple days. We're supposed to leave tomorrow, but... Well, the reason is we don't have a... A window to get a window to NASA. To NASA. NASA. Uh, so I just, and I got a charger problem. He thinks he got a charger no, problem. I think failed. he wants a new charger. I do want a new charger, but this is a real good reason to get one, is that this one's coming up in a failure mode, saying charger failure. So. I emailed Master Volt and oh. they haven't told me anything, so. Oh, you emailed them. Yep. Oh. So we get stuck out on anchor for a few days and you don't have a window just waiting at an anchor. We got I no don't have a charge. I have to start the engines to charge the batteries. Oh well, well that's worries of tomorrow, it's not today. If I look a little different in uh, this will be a separate episode or the same episode, but I could be different looking. I did go get a haircut, but I didn't film it. Oh yeah, he got his haircut. Yep. New image in uh, Spanish Club. We have friends here um, that we met 
uh, last year at Great Harbor, uh, Cassidy and Lauren, and they uh, have a new business. And we keep coming by, but we never seem to see them. Uh, so we're gonna go down and show you the boat. Apparently you can go dive and swim with the sharks. Cage diving with sharks. If Sheldon's ear wasn't uh, acting up, maybe that's something we would have totally checked out. It is face-to-face -face adventures. He's here for just a quick moment. You're leaving today. Face-to-face -face adventures. How's business? We're starting when? We're ready. Oh, you're ready to go? Yeah, we're ready to go. Okay, awesome. And we get, and it's a shark. Cage, Cage diving. Diving, yeah. and you get to see sharks. Yes, definitely get so to see sharks. So super shots. exciting. Check these guys out. Lots of fun, and we would be doing it, but Sheldon has an ear infection uh -oh. from our last dive. Oh. Last dive. oh, yeah? Yep. Been there, done that. Yeah. <laughs> It's not five bucks. It's like a serious operation. It's 30 gonna... bucks for two people, so I guess $15. $15? Each. Yeah, okay, so the cab is gonna be really 60 bucks back and forth. The ferries are 10 bucks each way, so 10, 20, 30, 40, plus 60. It's a hundred dollar deal. Just to get there. Just to get to Harbor Island. So, uh, you know what? You you own this. Well, you, that's you, fine. I, yeah, I wonder what a um, a captain would be to go uh, guide you through the Devil's Backbone. You say two hundred bucks, so you're yeah. you're paying half of the of what you could do with the captain. Yeah. To take you around, but then you got to come back too. Yeah. So. But that's fine. And then he's the, we met the we met a guy we were just talking to then, and he said. Um, we need a golf cart, but I mean, I'm just going over to. Are we going to do a golf cart? I don't know. I don't think we do because I think that we're just going to go look at the little stores. We're just going to go to the beach and we're going to go out for lunch. So it's a little bit expensive, but we're just going to see lunch. Harbor Island. Yeah. So we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. So what else did I learn? We, I was talking to a guy. There's pigs over here, and there's a huge turkey, and there's some ducks on the island um, that's been put there. But the pigs, there's two guys that take care of the pigs and feed them and give them water every day. So I like that. The pigs are still there for business, I think, to uh, like a tourism attraction. But they are fed. They're not just um, waiting on hot dogs from not just tourists. There. I'm not sure. It's hot dogs are not their main normal food. He said that the tourists bring them a lot of hot dogs. I mean, why I not think carrots? Be eating vegetables. Yeah, stuff. bring them carrots or some lettuce. I don't know. I, hot I, dogs are made of pigs. It's very not right. Okay, so people, if you're watching this and you go visit the pigs, like, don't bring them hot dogs. I think a carrot or some apples or bananas. Or... Anyways, so yeah, all I got. Apparently, they're taking care of them. But yes, they're taken care of, which made me feel a little better. And the turkey over there is super friendly. He loves you. So I'm not going. Are we going? No. We're not going. I don't even know what we're talking about. It. For info. Information, yes. Okay. Don't give them hot dogs. What is your thought rather than inside of the map? So Harbor Island. You give them up, yeah. Oh, perfect. Oh, Thank okay. you. Okay, perfect. Okay, look, see, Sheldon? Horses on the pink sand beach. How much were the golf carts? 45 bucks. Ferry number two. Sip, sip. 
lots of restaurants around here. That's the horses riding on the beach. So, how is Coral Sands? It's beautiful. What's first impressions? The whole beach is a nice area. It's very touristy, but you know, if you're into that, it's great. Resorts, yeah. I think it's probably one of the nicer resort areas in the Bahamas, probably. Yeah, it's just a lot of it, and it's very catered to it. Yeah, beaches. Yep. I don't know, the beaches aren't as nice as Exumas. We're very partial to the Exumas. Do you want a golf cart? Anybody want a golf cart? This is a golf cart. Um, there's the dive center show. That's it folks, we've come to the end of our pre-pandemic footage. Subscribe and click the notification bell because next week we'll bring you all up to current time. Back to the boat after a very long pandemic stay in Canada. It is not to be missed. Good glorious morning from Spanish Wells of Luthra. And today? No. It's not Spanish Wells of Luthra. What is it? It's just Spanish Wells. The Luthra is another mean? island over there. It's... <laughs> I don't think that's right. Yeah. Spanish Wells, Bahamas. Yeah. It's definitely part of the Luthra, I think. I mean, I Luthra is an island that's over there. Spanish Wells is a separate one. So we're going to Harbor Island, which is not in the Lutra. Harbor Island's by itself. Yeah. Oh, is that true? Yeah. Good morning from Spanish Wells, not in Eleuthera. <laughs>